going on, my Reds and Bulls? This is Real Rap. And Mika Boo. And today, y'all, we are here on another Mukbang. Mukbang, Mukbang, Mukbang. Yeah, y'all, we are here on this mac and cheese lobster. Lobster mac and cheese. Lobster mac and cheese. We actually got it from Aldi's. I saw mm -hmm. it at Aldi's and I was like, man, that's looking good. We're going to try this. Because, yep. you know, lo I mean, lobster. All this we having all kind of different stuff that you never even heard of before. So I wanted to try this, y'all. They ran out of the seafood boil bags. They, matter of fact, they discontinued the seafood boil bags. So bad news for everybody who didn't get to try the seafood boil bags because that's what we was in there looking for. So we came across this, came across this right here, and we was like, yeah, we got to get on this. <laughs> we got to get on this. So we're about to get into it because y'all, we, we hungry. We hungry. We ha ha ha. Uh, hungry. Let's get into this blessing. Let's get into it. Lord, thank you for the food we're about to receive in our body. Your name, Jesus, we pray. Amen, amen, amen. Amen, y'all. I'm kind of excited. Let me stir it up first, and then I'll show y'all what it look like. Yep. It, I think it has breadcrumbs on the top, if I'm not mistaken. Y'all can tell we on time. with Y'all see that steam rolling up out of there. <laughs> we, on, we on point with it today, y'all. Thank God. Mika ain't, ain't mad, you know. Raz bites. There it is. Raz bites. Get a bite of that. Huh? So we have the lobster macaroni and cheese and some broccoli over here. Mmm. How'd it taste? Pretty good. I mean, y'all, it's piping hot. Not bad. It's not bad. That's pretty good to be frozen. Mm -hmm. Lobster mac and cheese. And we put these in the oven, y'all. You can put them in the microwave. Or you can put them in the oven. Mm. And I just did some frozen <clears throat> broccoli. Something real quick, simple, and easy. Mm hmm. Mm. Can you pass me that, please? I hate when I get those. Hard pieces of broccoli. Here you go. Mm. And we're drinking on cotton candy sparkling water. What y'all know about that? The cotton candy sparkling water. I saw these in Walmart for the first time. I think one day last week. And I decided to get it and try it. And it's pretty good. Mm hmm. It is. Let them get real cold. Yeah, it's how y'all doing today? It's how they doing in there? How all our ribs and booze doing today, y'all? We hope y'all doing well. Staying safe. Mm hmm. COVID free. <laughs> you know? Mm. This broccoli, I season this broccoli good. Yeah. Yeah, that broccoli bust. Mm-hmm. For real. So y'all, um, we do have a little topic to talk about. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> What's the topic? The topic is, hold on, let me, because I don't want to say it wrong, so hold on. Mm -hmm. The topic is today, is it a topic or is it maybe a question? I don't know. Topic, question, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> Would you date someone significantly older or younger than you? What are the terms of the age and you dating? And why would you date someone significantly, significantly older than you? Or why would you not? Older or younger than you? Me, <clears throat> if I date somebody significantly older than me, as a man, cause you know, women, they try to run you over. <laughs> a what? A woman try to, especially the older women, they try to run you over now, try to handle you all kind of ways and whatnot. But if I date somebody older than me, they have to have a lot of respect for me. You know what I'm saying? 
that respect got to be there first. You, you ain't, we ain't about to date you, and you think you gonna tell me what to do and how to do it and when to go and when to come and nah, we ain't doing that. How much older or how much younger would you date? Um, I wouldn't date nobody no older. Let me see. Probably three, no older than three to five years older than me. Three, three at the least. Okay. For me, I think as girls, when you, you know, you was younger, I feel like a lot of girls thought it was cool or it was, you know, you was popular if you dated somebody older than you. Mm-hmm. Guys, guys just think that too. Yeah. Oh, I, I got an older woman. I was always one. Oh, go ahead. I'm sorry. No, go ahead. I was always one that dated. Always dated a guy that was maybe a year or two older than me. Mm. So I don't. I don't see nothing wrong with. It. I never dated anybody. I'm about to laugh. Rap is younger than me. <laughs> so I have dated people that was younger we than me. We were born the same year. We was born in the same year, but you are still younger than me, honey. <laughs> yeah, about. Five months? No, seven months. But you're still younger than me. I don't care if it's a month, you're still younger than me. <laughs> hey, she trying to brag. <laughs> you trying to brag about that shit. Are you trying to say I'm a jitterbug or something? That's not what I'm saying. Because uh -huh. we are both the same age. I just happen to be a few months older than you. You and I, was, I said that to say, I, I was about to say, I've never dated anybody younger than me, but then I was just about to lie because you seven months younger than me. <clears throat> That's the only reason why I said that. Ooh. You gonna turn 50 before me. That's all good, huh? That's a blessing. It's a blessing. It's a blessing. I welcome 50. Y'all, we, we ain't nowhere near 50 yet. <laughs> <laughs> So I started the trend in even turning 50. We still got 10 more years to go, y'all. I know, right? So, you trying to get there. But I would not date somebody that's maybe like 10 or 15 years younger, I mean, older than me. Well, or younger than me, I wouldn't. Because from my experience, older men, they try to manipulate the younger girls. Yeah. And I personally know somebody like that. that uh, that's what I'm saying. Like, you date somebody that old, older than you, they gonna try to dictate a lot of things that you do just because they feel like they older than you and they probably <laughs> think they know more than you. Or, you know, they try to be your daddy or they try to be your sugar mama or whatnot. Mm-hmm. And they feel like you can easily be persuaded. Mm hmm Which in a lot of cases, that that is the truth though. That's just like um But you got some women that they older men that's old enough to be their daddy. For financial stability. But, yeah. Like Ron Asley. Ron Asley is dating. No, he ain't dating. They married, ain't it? Oh, yeah, yeah, they married. He 81. They look good together now. He 81. And she 45. You should just put up a picture in the video. Yeah, I should just put up a picture. <laughs> He 81, she 45. Now, girl, you the MVP. Because you know what you're doing. 
You know what you're doing now. You you in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You go get that bag. Believe that. I definitely cannot date somebody that much older than me. 81 and 45? Because what do y'all have in common, really? Your drive, y'all drive not even the same. Like, I don't, I don't know. I, don't, uh -uh. I can't do that. Unless she taking about some strong ass Viagra. I don't know. Uh -huh. But when I see stuff like that, you in it for the bag. Cause there's no way. No, I, you can't say that because she might really be in love with him. She might be really, really be in love with him. Yeah, she might be really bad. At the end of the day, you know you gonna get that bag when he leave him. I, I'm not gonna judge anybody <laughs> or say anybody in it for whatever reason because I don't know. No, you just said that a few minutes ago that. I, I, I'm uh, saying personally, personally, I don't know. Those are my feelings. I feel that way, but I'm not gonna say that that's the reason she's. Oh, angry. okay, okay. Cause yeah. you just never know. Yeah, you never know. But from what I seen in the hood, a lot of women be out here trying to get that bag out of the old men. <clears throat> and you can't say that it don't happen, cause it do happen. I know you don't seen it happen. I mean, I'm not in nobody's relationship. So you ain't ever you ain't ever seen a woman get with a, a older man that's old enough to be their daddy, and you like you know you know you know you in there you ain't you don't really love that he could be in a wheelchair and all that. I mean, I just, that, that's something that I can think is is the situation, but who am I at the end of the day to really say that that is the situation? Some situations, yeah, you could be like, okay. You know, it's genuine or whatnot. But in certain situations, I know you done seen that before. <clears throat> I know I have. <laughs> but hey, if, you, if you're trying to get the bag, hey, that's what it is. You know what I'm saying? So y'all, put down in the comments below, would you date somebody younger or older than you? And if so, what is the age range that you're willing to go? Drop that comment. Let us know. Did I say the age range that I'm willing to go? Uh, oh, excuse me. No, I don't think you really said it. I know I was like three to five years, I ain't three at the least for me. I'm not dating nobody five years younger than me. I'm not doing that. Mm -hmm. But I will date somebody five years older than me. Yeah. And I feel that way because and we all know it's a proven fact that men mature way slower than women. So I'm definitely not about to deal with somebody five years younger than me. I, I'm just not going to do that. Yeah. <clears throat> Y'all drop us a comment and let us know. What's the oldest of y'all date? And what's the youngest of y'all would date? Let us know. This broccoli is good. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I ain't got full. Y'all, if y'all haven't checked out our last video on the Slim Chicken video, y'all make sure y'all check that out. We have some great restaurants here in Columbia, South Carolina. Yeah, we're trying to bring the y'all. So if y'all ain't seen that one, make sure y'all go over there and check that out. The food was really good. Mm-hmm. So y'all, we ain't gonna keep y'all long. Yep. We just wanted to pop in and see how y'all was doing and talk to y'all for a little bit. Uh-huh. If y'all like this video, like, share, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell to be notified each and every time we drop a video. And definitely put in the comments um, your answers to the topics for today. Mm -hmm. We'd like to uh, get y'all feedback. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So till next time, we love y'all and we'll see y'all later. Bye y'all. Peace.